Hello guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Ruby Nuzlocke. And we left off right about here, I just spent the last 5 minutes trying to get my mic level set up. Because I tripped on my cat and broke my headset. So I am using my speakers, so there might be a slight echo. And you may hear me breathe in my mic every now and then, because it's really weird to play when it sounds only coming out of one side. Anyways, I am getting a new headset soon, and possibly a new microphone. A uh, standalone microphone, just for recording, so hopefully... Hopefully that would be useful, and I think there's a side quest here, actually. Do we have harbor mail? No, we have orange mail. Um, yeah, that definitely is a side quest. I think you get the coin case from that. Anyways, um, another topic that's come up, um, a lot of you may be seeing extremely large amounts of dislikes, at least for a channel my size, on my videos, and be wondering what the hell it's from. Well, no, oh, the TV's on, and we get HMO6. Well, simply put, at first I thought it was a unified attempt at trolling, like someone else's channel, um, just trolling me for the hell of it, so I was blocking people and removing comments at first. Turns out that instead, it was actually someone trolling B and over on 4chan, and they're stupid enough to fall for it, and they're stupid enough to think that I was the actual person. And so, of course, like the retards they are, they just did nothing but dislike and spam my videos. So anything that, any of their comments that wasn't original enough to make me chuckle, which is basically all of them, or wasn't actually asking a question, or that it didn't reply to, was removed. And at first a lot of them were blocked until I realized what was happening, and some of them, I doubt it, but a few of them may actually want to watch this stuff. If you happen to be blocked, and you happen to comment during those times, send me a PM and I'll unblock you, pro probably. And, um, yeah, um, so. Some of you may be blocked, um, hopefully I didn't block any legitimate viewers. Anyways, TV's on, let's read it. Pokemon Fan Club, on the air, get your opinions, and shout them on your behalf. Oh yeah, this was back at the other place at Slateport, with the person we talked to. And... You guys can read that. <laughs> And, yeah. So that's the whole TV reporter thing. Reporters show up there. They play more, more of a role in the, um, in the next game, Emerald. And yeah, it also finds sales on there for later in the game. Right off. Oh god, it's Wally. Just, we, we should just walk away, but no. And, yeah. Um, I think we should be full, fully healed. I think Chiaotzu is a bit, has a bit of HP off on him, but should be fine. Oh, oh wait, no, it wasn't Chiaotzu, it was Miss Fishy, the useless ass Pokemon. Um, let's see. Let's see what we have. We're going up against a Psychic type. Um, no, we'll keep Miss Fishy out. She's kind of death fodder at this point. Hopefully it doesn't come to, come to that, because we need as many team members as we can. You know what, fuck it, we'll just go for more attack. Um, yeah, that roll just fucked. <laughs> I forgot that he just spams double team. Fucking bitch. And that Ralts is dead. Good riddance. Miss Fishy made some points back. But not enough. Miss Fishy's going to hell because apparently I forgot to set my boxes up properly. Let's 
So I think we have to clear a dungeon before we could take on that gem and everything. And I think Rodent Turf Town is actually just off over there, so... We'll get the real champ out, uh, Mr. Fishy. And, uh, let's see... Yep, I did get my boxes messed up. So box one will be the death box, I guess. No? And... Switch. No. Stupid. Playing this on an Xbox controller, and it is a bit weird. And you know what? You're switching with, with Slavenator. So, I'll be grinding Mr. Fishy pretty much off, entirely off screen. But, yeah. Um, oh god, this guy. This guy is a big bard. What the fuck? <laughs> I swear to god, there is no lyrics in the old one when I first played. That was just... that was just awkward. Um... This is kind of the area of the game where I completely forget, like, everything, typically. Um... Yeah, we get the bike. And... We won't be getting everything we can, um, with these bikes. Because, personally, I don't like feeling getting everywhere if we have a pro bike, but the mock bike is the best one. Plus, you'll need it to get a legendary. Um, we could come and switch them out any time. So, yeah, we're gonna be pretty much using the afro, not the afro bike, the, um, mock bike entirely, because it's the fastest. And we're worried about transportation, so we'll assign that to P, if I could remember where it is. There we go, so now when we have select, we can get it on the mock bike that I can't ride for the life of me. Oh god, I forgot that that route's over there. Um, that's Pokemon Daycare that you just saw. Um, pretty sure the path is blocked up here. Oh yeah, the battle house. I remember where we are now. It's been too long since I played. So, you know what, how about we take on Cycling Road? Should be pretty quick. Um, should make a decent episode, and plus we'll be able to go get that harbor mail, and bring it back to that person. And hopefully get our coin case. This is... I don't know, battle? Wow. Um... I probably should have stopped at the Pokemon Center. Oh god, Slavenator has an item. Wait, there, there's actually a bag limited in this game? Looks like it wasn't this one that they moved it in. Um, toss. And yes, X speed needs to go to hell. Toss. Yes. Oh, yo. Yeah. Um, I think we're gonna save those work candies. Once Mr. Fishy gets up to a bit of a higher level, we'll just have him chow down on a bunch of rare candies. And looks like, um, Donut will be getting a lot of airtime here. Oh, I forgot to take it off of him again. Because, a lot of electric Pokemon in this area, and Donut is immune to electric attacks, although he could still be confused by this little bitch. Oh fuck, it has Levitate, doesn't it? Nope, never mind, my drop still hits. Mr. Fishy is already level 6. So this won't be hard at all. Another battle. I think there's only like four, 5 or 6 on there. 
Oh wait, we need to beat the gym before we get out there, I think, because we need Surf. Unless I completely ballsed up and forgot about Surf. And again, I forgot the item. Um, in this version, pickup uh, is actually a 10% chance after any battle, unlike the later versions. In which case, it's randomly as you're moving through the grass with a varying chance as you level up. So if this was Heart Gold or Soul Silver, which I may do a playthrough of, it would be absolutely amazing. We'd have like tons of rare candies by now and other crap. And I completely missed that, so I'm gonna stay out. I think it's yeah. Okay, good, it's another Magnemite. So ironically, despite being the water starter, it's our most effective Pokemon against electric. And my broken ass chair is getting annoying. So we we've got this biker dead. Um, I think this is the only game of non-thug style bikers in it. Um, apparently that person's never tried riding a bike using a 360 controller. How many fucking Magnemites are there on this road? Holy shit! It's fucking Magnemite City up in here. I'm on level 17 too. Gonna have to do some grinding, I think, later because most of my team's a bit under leveled, and I'll probably do it in another route because they're gonna have trouble in this area. And I think the next area we go to has fly actually, so we're gonna get the bike and fly relatively soon. Oh god, control V. That per someone someone just learned how to use control V apparently. Hey, you you battle. Your thighs are like rocks. That is disturbing. A another another fuck's sake. I swear to god, Donut's gonna get to the level 30 off of this. I should heal him up next. After this, cause... He is down about a third of his HP almost. Which... Eh... I really don't want to lose him, cause he's a powerhouse. Mr. Fishy is all the gates. No, I will not change Pokemon despite wanting to level Mr. Fishy. I will just mud shot all your Pikmin lights to death. Smash the A button. Oh god, it's a Voltorb. I have a feeling it's gonna self-destruct. Thankfully, it's only level 7. And we outspeed it. Voltorb is actually the fastest non-legendary Pokemon in the game, I think. Um, only with... it's actually ahead of Jolteon even. I think only Deoxys S form is faster. Well, one or two other Pokemon. So, we're going to... we need to sell that stupid ass revive. Because we can't use it. We're gonna level... not level him up. Bulbous HP, and we're finally gonna get this item from Slavenator. Or Restore, that's actually useful. Um, we're gonna pop on Ether as well if we have one, because Mudshot is getting low on PP. And I have a feeling we're gonna fight about 30 more Magnemites down here, so we're gonna need it. Battle. <sighs> There's a race going on here? The hell? Oh god. Baltorb. I have a feeling... I literally have a feeling it's just gonna self-destruct. Um, if only we had Miss Fishy here, we could just send her out and have her take the self-destruct. Okay, thankfully... Actually, the self-destruct isn't that scary at level 7, it shouldn't do too much damage. Let me guess, another level 7 Baltorb? Yep.
and next one should level me up. And a Magnemite, finally. God, how many electric Pokemon are we gonna fight in this area? Easy XP for Donut, though. Yeah, I think we're getting a bit over-leveled here. I don't care, though. Better safe than sorry, even if it means, like, 20 minutes of grinding off-screen. <laughs> I forgot that there's that guy that evalu evaluates you. And you can see just how bad I am on the bike. I think I'll actually switch out for the acro bike, because... Speed boost doesn't really help when you crash into every damn thing. So where's that damn mark? There we go. Yeah, a lot of shortcuts are available when you have the mock bike. So it's kind of good to have it. No, don't want to buy yet. I'm gonna sell it first. Just stop macking a goddamn it. Um, more restore. Oh shit, I just realized it's a full fucking restore! Oh my god! I, f I thought it was... Um, another item. I forgot what they're called. But the one that restores the... Um, whatchamacallit, the PP of each move by 10 or so. Screw the orange mail. Yeah, I thought it was a full heal. Which we'll actually keep, probably. Oh god, um, that scared me for a second. It was just probably for upgrading a new file. I hope. Um, we'll sell the revive. And we're basically swimming in cash. And let's see, we need to get the harbor mail. Bring it to that lady. And I think uh, how many poke balls do I have? I don't know. I'll buy another ten. Get a premier ball as well. I always use poke balls over. See the poke balls are ultra balls. Screw great balls. And I did not want to go in here. Yeah, we're gonna switch out for the acro bike. It may be a bit slower, but I could actually steer with it. Yeah. Um, for those of you wondering if I'll be doing those puzzles um, relating to legendaries that involve the mock bike, I may attempt to, but it depends whether I want to keep my sanity or not. Because you see how bad I'm doing right now on Cycling Road. Just imagine having to do it in a cramped cave. Not fun. Not fun at all. So, you know what, let's... Is that the bike shop? Yeah, it is. And you'll go switch it out for the acro bike. And hopefully we do not have to reassign it anymore. Yay! Oh god, this actually isn't too much faster. But you can do wheelies! And bunny hops as well. What purpose does this serve, you may ask? Well, there are certain puzzles you need for it, actually. Um, you need it for, and all that stuff. Started mumbling as I lost my train of thought there. So, I'll figure out if this is any faster than running off screen in between episodes, and if it's not, we will switch it out because there's no point in it if it's slow as shit. Unless we like wheeling everywhere. So anyways, gonna wrap it off here. Um, yeah, um, that's it, that's all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time.